Have you ever heard the story about a nine news reporter who was covering a haunt and vanished in the thin air? Legend has it he still lurks around trying to get to Bobby Mackey's. Way back in the 30s in the little town of Wilder. Been here 35 years. Oh, this is my life. This, this is my country music. It was the best place around. The musician and honky tonk owner has one of the best known haunts in the region. For the first 10 years I was here, I tried to keep all this down. I found out about the strange happenings. Bobby Mackey realized that the lure of the spookiness was worth embracing. Juan Decay now gives haunted tours of the bar. We get people that constantly ask, is this a haunted house? If I go down into the basement, is somebody going to jump out and scare me? We don't hire anybody to come out and sneak and grab you or anything like that. It's actually forbidden. So if you come through here and you see something, it's the real deal. There's been the occasional groping reported, trash cans thrown, and of course, images have been seen. But nothing happened while we were there today. Do you believe in it? Oh, not at all. Not at all. Johanna, Johanna. The legend is summed up in this musical tribute to the girl who supposedly died and how it all came to be. Is it true you're still here somehow? I pay no mind to it. I'm, I'm about country music. When I'm on stage on Friday and Saturday night and everybody's having a good time, the place being haunted is the farthest thing from anybody's mind. Where'd he go? Tony Moronis, nine on your side, wilder.